Here are the top five breakthroughs we have selected in the field of theoretical physics. A new theory of quantum gravity. The first breakthrough is in a proposal for a new theory of quantum gravity. For almost a century, theorists have tried to create a unified theory by quantizing gravity according to the rules of quantum mechanics. They still haven't succeeded, with the most popular approach being string theory and loop quantum gravity. This March, a theoretical physicist, Jonathan Oppenheim, proposed that gravity would not be quantum after all. However, there is still a need to explain the quantum interferences that you observe in experiments. In Oppenheim's theory, random fluctuations in space-time cause changes in the flow of time, thus breaking the concept of predictability and explaining the interference pattern. This is what Oppenheim calls the post-quantum theory of quantum gravity. Here's challenges, Penrose and Hawking probably. The biggest drama this year in theoretical physics is a challenge by Kerr, a giant in general relativity, to two titanic figures in 20th century physics, Roger Penrose and Stephen Hawking. We all know that black holes have a singularity where everything that goes inside black holes ends. It is a well-known fact. Or is it? Singularities don't exist, claims black hole pioneer Roy Kerr. The biggest argument for why a singularity must exist inside of black holes comes from Penrose and Hawking's singularity theorem. However, Kerr found a flaw in their argument. Kerr argued that Penrose and Hawking showed only the end of a fine length inside black holes. And he gives reasons why it doesn't imply the existence of a singularity. New Quantum Algorithms the third breakthrough is in the field of quantum computing. A new paper this year proposes a quantum algorithm that can simulate coupled quantum oscillators exponentially faster than any classical algorithms. First, they present a quantum algorithm that can solve the problem in polynomial time. Second, they prove that no classical algorithm exists that can solve the problem at the same time. They present a sample problem with a system of masses and spring at each vertex of a graph. Solving the problem takes polynomial time for a quantum computer while exponential for a classical. A new kind of phase transition. We have heard about phase transitions, such as water hardening into ice or water into gas. This year, a new kind of phase transition was proposed with a transition between information phases, one where information remains safely spread out among the particles, and one in which it is destroyed through repeated measurements. Entanglement naturally spreads through a group of particles due to interaction among them. But if you measure the particles frequently enough, you can stop the entanglement growth. The researchers proved that if you increase measurements beyond a critical rate, entanglement would drop. And if you decrease measurements beyond that rate, entanglement would increase across the chain. This phase transition with low and high entanglement is called information phase transition. New results in holography. The final breakthrough in our list is a new result in holography, an approach to quantum gravity. During the past decades, Theorists have been studying quantum mechanical systems that are believed to describe black holes. Maldekina proposed a new quantum system that is supposed to describe a black hole in an emergent universe. This quantum system could even be simulated on a quantum computer. Maldekina makes an estimate of 7,000 qubits necessary to see some black hole features.